So what was your, your session about? I'm talking about the future uh, and the future of work, the future of recruiting, uh, what's really happening in our space. Uh, and obviously, since the coronavirus and the advent of AI, uh, things are changing pretty rapidly and will continue to change. So I'm, I talk a lot about um, and what's recruiting going to look like in five, ten years from today. And obviously it's going to look very, very different, I think. I think we're going to see lots of things that we currently do every day automated. And we're going to see that we have to do a lot of things that we haven't done before or haven't done well before. More focus on the recruitment, the candidate experience, more focus on content creation, more focus on coaching, uh, more involvement with the hiring managers in the business. So less on the administrative side and a lot more on the, the more um, uh, value-added side, I would say. Yeah. Yeah. And is, is COVID um, uh, the big change maker or uh, AI? How they both. I mean, I think lots of things were happening before COVID very, very slowly. COVID accelerated it, made it happen quickly. Uh, and right on top of COVID came AI. And so it's kind of hard to say which was more important. Uh, but I think in the long run, AI will be the winner. I mean, that's, that's the real change agent. Uh, COVID was more of the, the, the kick in the butt. It pushed you. Uh, but AI is changing things fundamentally. So about AI, what's what's um, you always said it's the big, the big, the big change, uh, making the biggest change. Uh, can you explain it? Yeah, I mean, I think the the biggest change is it can do things that we used to do, and that we thought only people could do. So as a good example is, can you talk to a candidate in a real open way online and chat GTP? Yeah, you can. And it's only going to get better. Can you screen a candidate? Yeah, sure, very easily with ChatGTP. Can you do an assessment? Yeah, for sure. So I look at the whole thing from even finding candidates, attracting them, to engaging them, to screening and assessing them can all be automated to probably 90%. And people will have a role, but more as a, a coach, a guide, quality control expert, somebody who's overseeing the process, but not necessarily doing the process. So, I mean, that's fundamental. Uh, and I think ChatGTP can do other things like help onboarding new people, uh, answering any kinds of questions, uh, explaining the culture. So when you really, you really look at what ChatGTP ultimately will be able to do, maybe not today, but we'll be able to do in two to three years from now, it's pretty much the entire spectrum of recruiting, uh, which says then, so what do we do? Uh, what, are, what are recruiters do, and I think there's still a very big role for recruiters, maybe fewer of them, but still there's going to be recruiters, but they're going to be doing things like I mentioned before, coaching, content creation, uh, much more value-added things. And is it something which changes within a year, or does it take uh, three to five years for recruiters? I mean, I think we're all caught up in the hype that it's all going to change overnight, but nothing ever changes overnight. I think it will be faster than we think. Probably, I'd say, two to three years from now. I think it's probably going to be the fastest any technology has been adopted. Uh, and it may not necessarily be adopted actively by recruiters, but it's going to be built into the products they use. And, and that's really the fundamental difference. So what do you think about the, big, uh, the biggest three uh, tech trends? Well, I mean, obviously, number one is that chat GTP or some equivalent is going to be built into every product out there. So there's not going to be any recruiting tool that doesn't have uh, an element that's AI. So I think that's probably the most important thing. I think the second thing is things that we have always looked at more as helping us are going to be able to take over what we're doing. So rather than uh, having a video interview and then we look at it and decide, the software is going to make recommendations for us. Again, that's AI based. So I think the, 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 the Trend number one, trend number two, and trend number three is AI. <laughs> and it's just going to be built into every single product out there, uh, consumer product or recruiting product. Uh, so I think we're going to live in a world we never thought of before, where, you know, you're going to be able to, to, to I think a candidate ultimately be able to walk, to open up a, 
a site and just say, verbally speaking, say, uh, tell me what opportunities uh, there are at um, whatever company, uh, given my background. And ChatGTP will know their background and will be able to scan opportunities and say, here are three companies you might be interested in and here are the positions. I mean, we've never been even been able to close come to that before. So I think that's going to be possible within the next three years. So pretty amazing stuff.